hi guys yeah welcome back to vicky's corner so guys so this is miss trudy a kenyan youtuber you know and she's engaged to a ghanaian youtuber Odemaya. so now miss trudy has been engaged to Odemaya for you know like a year now and everybody has been you know anticipating this wedding we all have been waiting for this you know youtube wedding we can't wait to have it we are just here waiting for the wedding and then boom miss trudy went and bought a house yes so now why will a woman who wants to get married go and buy a house are you thinking what i'm thinking now if you want to know just wait i have certain things i want to analyze here and i will want you to you know listen to this video now why will a woman who wants to get married who has been engaged for like over a year going to buy her own house and then she furnished the house from the beginning you know to the end like i mean from spoon to furniture level from spoon the furniture level that's what she did and she bought her own house her own house okay an apartment that she got in one chinese you know building and so on and you would begin to wonder is she still ready to marry with the maya are they having issues why is she buying a house when she's supposed to you know be married and they are planning to get married and you know this old thing has taken time and people are even thinking that ah, yes this year they will get married and now she's going to buy a house now see what i have to say concerning this whole thing i think women should have money you know of their own yes now when a woman have money of her own these are certain things that would definitely happen she will begin to think you know responsible yes because now see miss trudy for the fact that she's getting married to Odemaya, she still have the mindset of having her own properties is very good now this is an african lady thinking like this before we used to see all the whites thinking of having their own things before getting married it's very important for a woman to have her own money before getting married yeah because nobody actually wishes for anything but some people are actually in marriages that don't favor them but they can't live because they are broke yes because that is why you see some celebrities the moment they are maybe the marriage is not moving well they move you get but some people will even stay in a marriage in fact they will stay in a relationship that they've not even married them but they cannot even live because you know why they don't have the money to even live whether the person is treating them bad or not they will stay some even go ahead to even give birth to kids to a man that have not even married them but they will still stay and be hoping wishing that one day the marriage happens you get because for miss trudy as she is like this eh engaged to someone that probably ends in millions on the street but yet she have this you know self-esteem you know to have our own property have our own house man i really love this girl and she just my kind of girl i always believe that a woman should have her own properties have you thought about this whether they are getting married tomorrow or it's even next week she having a house is not going to stop her from you know getting married to Odemaya. yes because number one the house can be you know given to her father can be given to even her sister and it doesn't make any difference if she's married today she's having kids and these kids now inherit her house that is one thing women don't know that is why sometimes women want to die on top one particular man whether he's cheating on them or beating them or and all that they will still stay because they feel that whatever they have worked for whatever they have suffered for is with the man and for the man now have properties and they have kids for the man and if they divorce the man the whole property will go to that person so they want to stay there and die put with that marriage because they know that they don't have any writing aside to give to their children they have to take what belongs to their father now i'm only here to talk to a woman a single girl here and so on whether you are getting married tomorrow or it's in the next 20 years please try and have your own property it doesn't stop you from getting married she can be married and still will this property to you know her children as a woman as your husband is willing you too you are willing will your own you to have your own lawyer will practice okay that is the way it should be a woman should not just be there waiting for what her husband will give uh, if my husband this and uh, uh, it's, it's my children that will inherit my husband's property it's not always like that you 
You there sitting down there, what will you give to your own children? Are you going to wield the pots in your kitchen? Look at Miss Trudy, look at this how she bought. Hmm? And this lady is somebody I like, I just love her for doing this. Because whether they marry tomorrow or not, her house is her house. There is nothing wrong in even both of them tomorrow, even when they are married. After all, Bodemaya will be living in Ghana. Sometimes they can come to Kenya and then have holiday in their house. Okay? Tomorrow they can bring the kids to our own house, have fun there. So the house is comfortable and beautiful. That is the way women should do things. Not all these ones that some women will have nothing. All they do is depend on a man. Some will go as far as, you know, packing their load to stay with a man for years without being married. Just because they want to be there. They want to choke their eye there and all that. See, there is no, there is no pride. Eh? When, see, there is nothing like, you know, this sweetness when a man legally marries you before, you know, you pack yourself to go and be a liability there. And so many women even do it too. Even... So our celebrities, yeah. You see, even right now that Two Face is married, some ladies are still even giving bets, you know, for for Two Face. Now again, we heard another one that another one is pregnant again. These are women that don't have, you know, self esteem, self confidence. They are so, in fact, they are liabilities. That's why I see it. Okay, see, see people that you know go and get pregnant for for the video, whiskey, and so on. Even when they know this one already to marry them. They feel that, ah, with my babies, I'm going to buy the art of this man. If I have babies, one day is going to marry me. Women, learn, learn, learn. A man that is not ready to make you a wife should not make you a mother. That is one thing, because even God said it. You have to be, you know, a mother, a, a wife first before mother, okay? So you opening your legs for a man, just like that. That have not, you know, done the right things and then going to have kids. But if it's someone like Miss Trudy now, there was a time she was living in Maya's house in, in, in Ghana. I was thinking that maybe she wants to stay there till they get married. For where? She has her own house now. It's not some people, not even some people, they will be pregnant for Maya by now to hold him down. Say, ah, this one that I've caught Maya like this. Say, oh, Maya like this. Ah, let me stay with you more. The next thing they will go and start having babies. You see, if a man truly loves you, eh, he will get you in, like, he will marry you. He will hold you down. And by holding you down is by legally marrying you. Okay? That is the right way. Not the one that you just go and pack your load and go and stay with a man. So many people do it to celebrities. I know a lot of celebrities that have baby mamas everywhere. You know, sometimes when you become a baby mama, it happens that you are the one now begging for the man to marry you. Yes! But nobody will say it. Everybody will be keeping quiet like say, eh, hey, even we know two-faced, uh, some of two-faced baby mamas that are still fighting to enter where Annie is. Ah, uh, I don't know. I don't know what people think. Now, this is her dad and her sister. They brought balloons and everything, you know, to open her house. And this was one of the sweetest moments, okay? You see, this is self-respect. Even the man will respect you. A man that knows that you have self-worth will respect you. And have you noticed that a man that knows that you have your own properties, he can't do any If you do any you will live in. Those men tend to respect their wives, their partners, more than the ones that they know that this one, if I kick her out, she does not have anywhere to go. Now my house, she did. So a few does, you know, oh my God. Like, I just love this Trudy. I love her. And I pray that both of them get married one day, you know. And this self-love, self-respect will always be there. I'm sure Maya will worship Trudy. And, you know, even when he's not even against it, he's actually supporting her. You know, there are some men that don't even support their wives growing big in life. Yeah. Well, they might ask up to like 1 million, more than 1 million subscribers. She, Trudy has 300 and something subscribers, 300 and something thousand subscribers. And yet, well, they might still support her. Even under the comment section, you see his comment saying, congratulations, babe. That is the way it's supposed to be. Not you just going to have a baby for him. What if maybe Trudy was like all these girls that would just go and say, ah, eh, please let me have a baby for him first so that he will not leave me. You end up having a baby for a man and you'll be there having more babies and he will not marry you until family intervene. So many people are doing it. It even happens around my my, my, my city too, it happens. I see a lot of girls bringing themselves down before men, having kids anyhow. Before sometimes it's the family that will not beg and so yeah, come and marry. Come and marry. She has had kids for you. Come and marry. As in, like, oh, it's shameful. I think women should do better, okay? Do better. A man that is not ready to make you a wife shouldn't make you a mother. 
Because after being that, 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 that wife, you can be a mother later. That is it. So I don't know. I always believe in this thing that anybody that would not bring themselves low to have kids outside before, before they will now come and marry you. It's like Tokumbo. That one or uh, Kereka is thrift market. You are not new. Okay. And then won't you say yes when they now finally propose to you? You go say no before. You don't already old now. Yes, you don't really old for the matter. So you cannot come and be saying no when they, you know, propose to you. That's what happened around HQ on Facebook. A baby mama finally, you know, got, you know, got a proposal and she now said, I said yes. Madam, you for talk no. After giving birth, I'd like, what, what were you expecting? Were you going to say no? Like, he's even helping you to marry you, my sister, you know? That's what we were dragging that lady on Facebook that time. You don't have to, you don't have to come and be doing, I said yes. Please, you've already said yes since inside his bedroom. Saying yes with your vagina, scattering everywhere, having kids. So which one is I said yes? You'll be saying yes since. So guys, if you're a lady here, yeah, please do well. Let a man respect you. See, I always believe that a man that loves you so much eh, will marry you before having kids. That's why I see because having kids do a lot of things to a woman's body. So a man that is not, you know, cannot marry you. Shouldn't make you a mom. Not be beg marriage and I'm supposed to do. Bye, guys.